Hey guys, Matt here with Crypto Blick. Hope you're having a fantastic day today. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to properly shut down your miners and your rig so that you can either update the software or be able to modify some parts on your rig or maybe you need to add another GPU, whatever it may be. Uh, this information I found through researching and following other minor youtubers here on youtube and so this is not just my opinion but this is what the pros as i consider they do so if that sounds good to you let's hop in and let's get started all right so i'm in hive os here and i'm looking at my different gpus that i have available i've got my settings going it's it's mining away all right it's running the algorithm well so what do you do when you want to like i said change out a GPU or add another one to your rig, or maybe there's something, uh, you know, some other contraption you wanna put on your rig or, or change some cables. Well, what you're gonna do here is come up to the minor action section. Go ahead and click on stop minor. And then what you want to do is you want to let those rigs or the GPUs, I should say, you want them to cool down. So give it at least two to three minutes, okay? Uh, don't do it right away. You wanna stop your miners first. So the rig is still going, as you can see here. So let's see if you guys can see that. So the rig is going still right now, but I shut the miners off, okay? So the miners are shut off. Let me refresh the page here. So it's only going for about 29 seconds. I'm gonna pause the video here, come back after three minutes and we'll go from there. And we are back and you can see I'm at three minutes and 37 seconds right now. So then come on up, because keep in mind guys, the reason you shut down your miners first, you want them to cool down when they, they're on high temperatures so that you don't have any uh, melting going on within the GPU or causing any issues and cracking of any parts. Uh, because of the heat so let those gpus cool down all right and then come on over to power actions shut down and then you can shut it down confirm right there it will do its thing or if you want to do a reboot click reboot um, and then one last thing here so you've got your miner shut down let's say you need to update your software go ahead and to upgrade or downgrade um, in this case, if you have a rig that has not been updated to the most current version, it's gonna be in yellow. I've already updated, but you're gonna you know, select the current version, do force upgrade, and then reboot after complete. Let me show you what it actually looked like here. So let's downgrade. Um, then be reboot after complete and be force upgrade, and then you do the button that would say upgrade for you, okay? So that is how you will update appropriately um, on your rigs. For me, I'm just gonna go ahead and do the power actions and then do a reboot because I want everything to come back up and start mining again. So that's what I'm gonna do on my end and do a reboot. Um, it's going to go through the system. It's gonna shut the rig off and then it's gonna turn it back on and then my miners will start mining. So guys, as you can see, it's pretty simple to uh, be able to shut down your miners and then also your rig. Uh, just don't shut it down instantly. Don't go and just like turn off the power to your rig because you wanna make sure everything cools down appropriately so that you don't cause any damage to your rig or your miners. So if you guys found that helpful, hope you did. Leave a comment below, like the video, subscribe to my channel because I will be producing more content for you that hopefully is valuable to you from what I find through my own testing, but also through watching other professional miners on YouTube. So if you have any suggestions or comments, leave them in the comment section below. And until next time, I'll see you when I see you.